हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम संजय गुप्ता इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट स्किल बेस्ड इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन रिलेटेड टू सी बिफोर स्टार्टिंग यू कैन नोट माई इन्फॉर्मेशन विच इंक्लूड माई ऐप बुक्स एंड यूट्यूब चैनल सो दिस इज फर्स्ट कोर्ट सेगमेंट यू हैव टू आइडेंटिफाई इट्स आउटपुट सो यू कैन सी फर्स्ट स्टेटमेंट इज कंटेनिंग अ स्ट्रिंग इन टू एस देन टू पॉइंटर्स पी एन एस टी आर वन आर डिक्लेयर देन एस ऑफ थ्री एड्रेस इज असाइन इन टू पी then s is copied into str1 and then printf is printing uh, integer value based upon uh, this expression so its output will be 77 now i am going to explain how this 77 will be printed so s is containing this uh, string then uh, two pointer p and str are declared so uh, s of 3 address is assigned into p so a is zero index b1 c2 and slash n is on three index so three index address will be assigned into p that's why p is containing slash n address then s is completely assigned into str1 so str1 is also pointing s then printf it will print an integer value so first of all we have to calculate these two expressions so if i solve uh, right hand side first so str1 then asterisk so str1 is pointing uh, this complete string then asterisk means Uh, value at its base address so base address always indicates first location so base address value is a so at asterisk str1 will provide a it is subtracting uh, from 32 so uh, now we have to convert a into its ascii value so ascii value of a is 97 so 97 minus 32 is 65 then plus plus will be performed So 65 plus 1 is 66. So this expression will provide 66. Now coming on to this part, plus plus asterisk p. So p is containing address of S3. So S3 means this location slash n. So slash n's ASCII value is 10. So if we increase 10 uh, by 1, so it will become 11. so now you can add 11 and 66 output will be 77 this is another code segment here array is declared then pointer p is uh, containing address of a uh, so a is representing array so its name will provide base address into p then uh, there are two loops inside first loop value of a is printed and a is incremented by 1 in second loop value of p is printed and p is incremented by 1 so now first check its output oh it will provide compilation error l value required so reason is this statement a++ so c we are incrementing value of a so a is pointing to this array and its base address so uh, a is declared as array so we cannot increase uh, any array because it will uh, change its base location if we try to do so so this statement will provide compilation error similarly if we increase any pointer which is containing base address of any array so this statement is valid it will not provide any kind of error so you cannot increase any array because it uh, points to base address of an array but if we assign address of that array into a pointer then we can increase its address this is another code segment so here 3 by 4 matrix is required so first i am drawing 3 by 4 matrix this is first row then second and third row and it will be divided into four columns so this assignment will be for first row 1 and 2 so 1 and 
remaining will contain zero then these values will assign into second row 4 8 and 15 so this is 4 8 and 15 remaining will be zero and we have not initialized third row so all values becomes zero so this is initialization of this 2d array now we have to print a02 so 0 index 1 index and 2 index similarly 0 index 1 index 2 index and 3 index so we have to print 0 2 so, so 0 2 means this location so this location contains 0 so output will be 0 so remember if we initialize any 1d or 2d array and with less number of values then uh, the remaining values will be uh, automatically 0 this is another code segment here c is array then p and q pointers are receiving base address of c then there are two loops so first loop is printing value of c and incrementing q second loop is printing value of p and incrementing p so here output will be same through first loop because we are uh, always printing value of c while incrementing q but in second loop we are printing p as well as uh, increasing its value so you can see first output 2 2 2 5 times so this output will be printed printed because of first loop because uh, asterisk, asterisk c means base address value that is 2 and second loop will print 2 3 4 5 6 because asterisk p first time is indicating 2 then p plus plus uh, uh, transfers address to next location so next location contains 3 then 4 then 5 and then 6 so you have to identify its output here two simple strings are declared s1 and s2 they are initialized with bmw and audi famous cars then s1 equals to s2 uh, we are trying to uh, assign value of s2 into s1 and then printf is printing value of s1 so it will not provide any kind of output it is providing error that is syntax error uh, reason if we copy a string into another then strcpy function is required so remember if you try to assign value of a string into another then you cannot you cannot use only single equals to operator you have to implement strcpy function to copy values of a string into another so i hope these question and answers will be beneficial for your interview and viva purposes so uh, learn uh, something about uh, learn, sorry learn something from these questions so uh, you can uh, give answers uh, while facing any kind of interview or viva thank you for watching this video